Radio.com. We are going to find out the sum of n terms of an AP. The question here it is: find the sum of the first twenty-two terms. Find the sum of the first twenty-two terms. Twenty-two terms of the AP. Of the arithmetic progression, eight, three, minus two, etc., etc. Eight, three, minus two, etc., etc. Now we have to select an equation. We have to select the equation according to the question. In the question, we know the first term, a, is equal to eight, and we can find the common difference from the AP. Common difference d is equal to A two minus A one is equal to three minus eight is equal to minus five is the common difference. Now, last term is not knowing, but n is known to be twenty two. It is given in the question. N is equal to twenty two. So we are knowing n common difference d and the first term y. So we can select the equation. Sum of the first n terms as n is equal to n by two into two a plus n minus one into d. We can select this equation and substitute the values. N is equal to twenty two. Therefore, twenty two by two into two into first term. A is equal to eight. Then plus n minus one. N is equal to twenty-two. Therefore, n minus one is equal to twenty-one. Into common difference d is equal to minus five. Common difference d is equal to minus five. Now, twenty-two by two is equal to eleven. Two into eight is sixteen. Plus twenty-one into minus five. It is minus one hundred and five. Now, yes, twenty-two. We are finding yes, twenty-two. Yes, twenty-two is equal to eleven into what is sixteen minus one hundred and five. We have to subtract sixteen from one hundred and five and give negative sign because one hundred and five is the larger number. Now one zero five minus sixteen. It is minus eighty-nine. So sum of the first twenty-two terms. Yes, twenty-two is equal to eleven into minus eighty-nine. It is minus nine hundred seventy-nine. So the answer is sum of the first twenty-two terms. Sum of first twenty-two terms is minus nine hundred seventy-nine. Okay. It is very easy to find out the sum. The selection of the equation must be uh, valid. If, if we are selecting the equation in an apt way, it is very easy to find out the sum. Otherwise, it will be difficult to find out the sum. So be very careful when we are selecting the equation according to the given question. So the answer is minus seven hundred ninety-nine. Okay.